Christian from Berlin, let's not waste time, we have a lot to do, Riders on the Storm. This version is uh, with an extract of the solo, it's not the whole big solo, a couple of highlights and I simplify a little bit. The whole long solo, um, the original authentic transcribed solo is coming tomorrow or day after tomorrow. The transcription is finished, just need to cut a little bit and so if you want to have a look at that for a few more advanced look tomorrow or Monday. So I wish you a lot of fun with this uh, piece of music history. Let's get to work and uh, have fun. So here we are with the Riders on the Storm. Let's start straight away with the bass line. It's uh, this one. The beauty of it is, it's your metronome, E minor, and A, and it goes on, I will simplify now the left hand to just fourth notes. And now we have this really nice sounding, you should try the same, fourth and fifth finger, I call it a two finger slide, classical, call it accidental, I stay with my terminology, yes, practice it, it sounds nice. So we have syncopation, syncopation. One more time. All in all, it should sound like lovely riff I find. That's the piece of genius always if it's simple and yet sounds so unique. Now we have the melody. The melody doesn't give us much headache. We have, we take three verses and uh, we start with the first one. I recommend play the first one. Very simple and reduce. Riders on the storm. Okay, now again, that's very easy, but like. And after this, you should enter right away into the um, riff. That way it sounds much better, because we are now having the vocals, the lyrics, and the riff in the background. We gotta combine them, and we do it like this. start, you catch up with the riff here on the C sharp and the A. Now, again, one and two and three and four and one and two and three. One more time. can become a bit tricky for some, again, because the melody is doing its bit and the left hand is doing a bit. I promise, it took me also a couple of seconds to manage. So, yay, we do again.
And one last time. Yes, it, this will cost you about half an hour. What you learned before, okay? You're entering right there. And now, this one. And then we have the third bit that goes like this. And this is easy. What we do have is D and C. You heard about those chords, especially about the C, right? Okay, now the melody is we grab the chord as often as we can. It's so easy my sofa can play it. Maybe the cushion also. Okay. And C. And and then new verse starts or solo. So it's uh, almost the same. It's like he's hanging before before we had this on the storm and now it's there's a killer on the road or on the run, I don't remember. There's a killer on the dumb. And you do the just the same, it's repeating as well. That's the whole difference. Just that little bit. And that's why we don't do the full stuff again. We have to save time here because we want to do some solo as well, okay? The third verse is... Okay? So we have the three verses. Fabulous. There's a killer on the road. You can strengthen the melody a little bit by... Just like that. Like that. You can do in the third verse like... can add the slide.
Now, of course, what everybody wants in their solo is the rundown. That is in its original, of course, played. We do it one gear slower for, for everybody to be able to play it. We do it like this. And once you get good enough, you speed it up to triplets. We start. Put your finger, fifth finger, on the B. Ready? You found the B? You found the piano? You found back home from last night? Okay. Now we have the fifth finger. Now we're going in third. And it's very important here that you also take the right finger setting. Otherwise, you get stuck. And we don't want that. Now, five, three. Now you take the next third, it's this one. You can follow, huh? I don't get slower than this. You better start watching now. So, these are the first, this is the E minor bit. We start here like. Here we take the first over setting, fourth finger on the F sharp. Again, we have this one. First over setting to the F sharp with the fourth finger. To D, they're all thirds, minor and major thirds. And three, and to the C sharp. Now we go, okay, one re repeated one once more for you. Over setting four, and that the thumb is in the end on the C sharp. Now we take the fifth finger again. You remember, we had him here, we have him here. He's for a change, good for something. On D. And now we do the same finger setting like before, what we had on. E minor we do now on G major chord except of course the C sharp is not in G major so we are now fifth finger on D three fourth finger on C sharp remember it's almost the same like here but we are now here now we do do four on A Go to F sharp. Then we have the third finger on G and one goes here. Again, fourth finger. On D, the second finger. And we are here. And we ha again have the thumb on the C sharp. If you don't have the thumb, thumb on C sharp here or there, you're wrong. Okay, now, thumb C sharp, fifth finger, doing the same architecture than before. Now we do two, four, three, one, two, uh, uh, four, two, three, one, four, two, three, one. And we are in the beginning. From here, repeat. Four, two, three, one, four, two, three, one, four, two, three, one. Four, two, three, one, four, two, three, one. Okay, yes, you got to watch out this one, but you wanted this. You asked for it. You begged for it. Okay, now. And you got to do it here. Five. Four. Four. Five. Four. Got it? Once more, one last time. Five, four, four, five. And once you're here, once you arrived here, 
fun and it's not an eight, uh, uh, it's not an, uh, well, what are they called? Eight notes anymore. Dum, dum, dum. And you come from here, you're landing here. D, do, D, 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 B, 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 dum, dum, dum. That is the run. So I would suggest for the ending, you coming down with these triplets. We, we make them a bit shorter here, we coming here. You rest here, I play it twice again. You're coming from here, well you're coming from here, but we should uh, make that shorter here. kind of an outro. So you rest here and then Or you do it really psychedelic if you're also on drugs like he was you just do that's the authentic way okay i hope you like it and um classic masterpiece See my next tutorial. Thanks for learning. Thanks for watching. And of course, as I said, the, the transcribed long solo is coming next days, hopefully tomorrow or day after. So you can have a look if you want to play it like this. You want to play it in the original speed. Then you go to that one. Bye bye. All the best from Berlin. I hope you liked my video and that you learned something. And now you can subscribe. Just press this subscribe button or click on another of my videos on this side. Thanks for watching. See you next time. Bye bye.